lovelies, it's Vanika Nia coming from her Natural Living Handbook. And today we are going to go over a brand new unit from Bosom Beauty with all the tea on the ins and outs of this new unit. If you need to get it, if it's better than the old one, the differences between the old one and the new one, the new settings, the levels, and the goods and the bads. So come on, come on, let's jump right in. <laughs> Here on this channel, we do videos about natural hair, beauty, of course, natural breast enhancement. So do make sure that you subscribe, hit that notification bell, join our natural living circle, and go ahead and like this so that I can continue to make more content tailored to your wants. If you are here, it's because you already know who Bosom Beauty is. You might already have a unit or you might be considering getting one. So let me just say, if you haven't got a Bosom Beauty unit already, then when you do go ahead and purchase, you will be getting the new one as the old one is now discontinued and there are no more. So let's look at the units. Here we have the old Bosom Beauty unit and here we have the new one. So let's go over the differences from the new one. Firstly, you can tell that this one is bigger than the older one, and it's also a different color. The old faithful orange boost button that we've all come to know and love has now turned red. The old Bosom Beauty unit has four controls, and the new Bosom Beauty unit has four controls as well. The new unit is a little more touch screeny rather than buttons. Even though they are buttons, it is more of a seamless kind of look. It is definitely something that we would see in today's day and age. Very similar to the old one, we have a port for the tubing. So this is how the tubing connects so that we can pump. On another side, we have the power entry, and that's how we can charge this. It is a rechargeable unit, just like the old one. So the interface is quite similar to the old one, but there are marked differences between the old and the new. So let's go over what they are. Because this is shiny, it's going to reflect a lot of anything that's in front of it. So I'm going to be a little conscious of that when I am filming this. But basically we have four buttons. The power button, the red change button, and the up and the down button, which of course makes the levels go higher or lower. The buttons are very, very sensitive to touch. So if I were to run my finger like that, it would basically turn the system on a tiny bit. See how the red power button comes on just by the slightest of touch. So that's the difference. Another difference is whereas the old one, when you pressed the orange button, it gave a boost. So it was like a power boost for five minutes. Now, when you press the new red button, what happens is it changes between three different settings. The three settings are stimulus, massage, and breast pump. That means when we're pumping, we have the choice. We can stimulate the breasts, we can give them a kind of massage, or we can pump them up. Over the last while since I've received my new unit, I've been playing around with all three settings. And my absolute favorite is pump because it just feels like it's doing the most work. But I will give you a little breakdown of my take on all three. Stimulus is short bursts. It's more similar to the boost. Massage is the lightest of all of them. Even when it's on the highest level, it feels like just a tiny bit of air pushing in and sucking out. 
and pump is the most effective for my liking because it gives a big pull and a big release. So it's like taking a big breath and a big exhale. I like that there are new settings. I think that that's really cool and it gives us different options while we are pumping. But I don't see myself using the other two settings as much as I'm using the pump. I so far haven't had any trouble with heating of the new unit, which is something that I definitely found with my older one. I don't know if it would be because I was sitting with it in my pocket or on my chest or on my belly or something, but it would get quite warm. And with the new unit so far from me trying it, I haven't felt like a heating. And maybe it's because it is a bigger unit and it can hold more power. Not sure, but I think that that's a cool addition even though the the overheating wasn't so much of a problem with my old unit but it's definitely something I noticed and something that I see when comparing the two now speaking of bigger the unit is bigger so if you are accustomed to walking around with your unit in your pocket you do have to hope that whatever pocket you're using is big enough to hold the new unit as it is bigger whereas the old one is 3.5 inches by 3.5 inches the new one is 4 by 4 inches the height of the small one is about 2 inches and the height of the new one is about two and a half what I love, oh my gosh, so anyone who has followed my progress with natural breast enhancement and with the pumps Nugleberry and Bosom Beauty knows that a problem that I had with Bosom Beauty was a tingly feeling that would occur if I wore them for too long. It made it so like nails on a chalkboard, you know, that absolute gritting teeth, oh, can't take. I felt that with the old one and with the new one, it's just not there at all, just completely not there. Something that I find quite remarkable with the new unit, which I didn't expect, and in comparison with the old one, I'm quite impressed with, is after pumping, when I'm finished, and this is after hours of use, it feels good, like good, like, you know when you have a good workout and you finish and you're like, wow, I feel tired, but good tired, like it relaxes you. So I found with this, and maybe it's because I no longer have the tingly feeling in one of my breasts, it just feels really nice and it feels like good work has been done. So I love that. I also love, even though the suction isn't as strong as the old one, what I love about the pump setting, and I tell you that, that's just my favorite one, is it really, really pumps. Like it pulls and it really releases. I don't love the release part, but the pump feels like a good, like I say earlier, it's like a big breath of fresh air. And I think that that is really helpful to my girls and it feels nice for them. So anything that is working to care for my girls, I love that. I also love that Bosom Beauty or the, the company Gizmo Store took in consideration reviews and what other users were saying because a lot of Bosom Beauts felt like the suction was really strong and some complained about it feeling a little painful and things like that. So the new unit is lighter. But for me personally, I don't like that as much because I like the strong pull. I feel like I was in the minority there because I had read about so many people complaining about it being really strong. And so when I got it, I was like, oh, let me try it on the lowest setting scared of everything that I had seen and read. But then I tried it and I was like, no, that's too light. I would get to about six or seven on the old one and I'm like, okay, yeah, I can do that for, for a while. But the new one, there are nine levels and I use all the way up on level nine and it doesn't feel too strong. It feels a little weaker than 
the other one for sure and I like a bit of a strong pull because for me it feels like it's extra working but I still love that the company took a lot of users into consideration and adapted because of that the bad something that definitely is different with the new one that I miss from the old is that when the old one cut off the suction would stay there for a good while. So I'd be able to sleep for a hot minute with them attached on because all of the air that was pumped was relatively still there. And it meant that my breasts could stay pumped for a longer amount of time. Whereas with the new unit, once the power goes off, it's off. The air is out and they're going to come off. Also, when you're switching between the different levels, it loses suction straight away between the switches. And no matter where you started, you will have to start back at one. So let me explain. With the old Bosom Beauty, if I finished at level six and the system shut off, when I started again, it would go to level six after the first two initial minutes. And I love that. With the new one, with massage, it always starts at level one. With the other two, I've been testing it out and it goes from level six. So if I am starting off with massage and it's level one, I might turn it all the way up to level nine. And then if I wanna switch over to pump, it will start at level six and I might push it up to level nine and then say I switch over to stimulus, it's at six and I push it up to nine, go back to massage, you would think that it would be at six or nine where you left it, but no, it's back to one again. That's something to be aware of if you are interested in the new system and that is something that is different if you had the old system. And it's something that I don't love, but again, because the buttons are very seamless, it's so easy to just get up to level nine quite quickly, but you do have to act quick so that you don't lose the suction if you are are shifting between the different settings. So I don't love that and I don't love that when I finish pumping that they lose all suction and have to come off. So for the new unit, chances of sleeping with them are slimmer than with the old unit. I do think that it is a great unit. I'm excited to use it more and notate any differences I see in the results of my girls and in the product itself. That is my review of the new Bosom Beauty Control Unit. If you already have the old one, I think that you are good to go. If you are interested in having different settings to try out for your breasts, then I think that it is a very good option from anything that I've seen on the market so far and if you haven't got the bosom beauty already I think that it is a fabulous electronic system for our breasts and it just gives them a lot of time to expand and to feel and that is a key component in natural breast enhancement I'd love to hear from you what your favorite setting is on the new bosom beauty if you have any tips please let let me know because I'm always happy to explore. Here's your weekly reminder to look after yourself. Take care of your girls. Take care of your mind, body, spirit. Treat yourself and have a fabulous day. Love ya. Bye.